I like walk around camp and hear what people talk about. The place? I don't know. So far, it seems okay, I guess. I think that there is rich pickings for some carpet baggers like us. Huh. Is that what we are? Is it avenging your father's death after thirty years? There's gold, Bart. Gold. If you say so. It's fun to listen to these people talk to us. What's Tilly doing? No, we're not playing dominoes. We should go donate. Can we upgrade? Medical... Provision lodging or station and boats. Okay, let's go horse. Nice, we can get stable horses here. I never use them. Next one will be the boat. That's all I needed to do. Hey, Micah. There she is. Oh, Mary Beth was the one who wanted the pen. So, what do you think of this place? Better than your little hermit camp, right? Oh, it's wonderful, Arthur. Thank you for asking. Yep. All right. Okay, so we did. We dropped off the meats. Oh, hey, Arthur. What you want, Micah? Nothing. I'm just being civil, my brother. Well, hello there. You really are a very charming man, aren't you? Micah and I don't get along. Yeah, I don't want to go fishing. Always good to see you. Hi, Arthur. Good cigarette? You gonna tell me women shouldn't smoke? No, just making conversation. Yeah, I'll leave you to it. Sure. She's a busty one. Hey, this is who we're going to go see right here. We need to talk to. We just rescued him from some bounty hunters. So, curious what he's going to get us into. Alright, just checking something real quick. Well, I know you think I'm just some effete before. I know you think I'm just some effete buffoon. A what? A man of words and not of action. Hardly a man at all. Well, I think you're as slippery as an eel in an oil slick, but still a man. Because I think I've... I've found something interesting. Yeah? Have you ever robbed a stagecoach? No, never. Well, who would have even thought? Of course I robbed a goddamn stagecoach. You know I have. And what's the problem with stagecoaches? The armed man attempting to put a bullet in your head? Not quite. The odds. I mean, is it worth the robbing? Sometimes. I know. But, well, if you'd like to come with me, I can introduce you to a new best friend, and he's he's going to give you all the decent, robbable stagecoaches a hot-blooded degenerate could require. Well, I could require a whole lot. Peace. You'll figure this one out. So where do we find this friend? The yours. Roads. Because what can possibly go wrong there? Well, lead the way and we'll find out. 
You sure seem to have got a bout around here. You know me. I like to make friends in low places. How the hell you end up down here anyway? I could ask the same of you. I have a few commitments over this way. Some expenses to meet. Expenses? What expenses? Gentlemen's canes and rabbits to pull out of hats? Among other things, I had quite a nice little business going for a while. Shares in a gold mining company. Excellent returns for the investor of a certain financial standing. Until, well, that unfortunate run-in with the law. Yeah, that's how it goes. Thanks for disappearing on us during that Sean business, by the way. I've done my part. Each to their strengths, dear boy. You know, you boys should really watch yourselves with those two families. This is a small town. People talk. I tried to mention it to Osea, but you know how he is. Anyway, while they're off chasing their pot of Confederate gold hidden at the end of some rainbow, let me present you with something real. So, where exactly are we going? The train station. The clerk there, Alden, is quite a fellow. And very informed on the comings and goings of coaches around these parts. Ah, I see. He was nice. I'll make the introductions, Arthur. Sounds good. Let's hitch up. All right. Let's watch the horses poop. I said times are tough. My missus is a bad woman. Terrible woman. They often are. But how's work, Alden? Terrible. Wages got cut again. They reckon they just invented a new horse's carriage will be the end of us. <laughs> They've been saying that nonsense since they invented the wheel. The witness of bosses. I know. My comrades here and I are greatly discouraged from the adequate fulfillment of our duty. A discouraged man is no man at all, Alden. No man at all. My friend Arthur here has a present for you. Here. Ain't you kind, sir. Call him Arthur. He's one of us, a fellow man of distinction. Okay. Well, this is perfect timing. I think you'll like this one, Josiah. It'll be coming south down the river road through Siltwater Strand. Thank you, Alden. Thank you very much. Oh, and Josiah, if you or Arthur are ever out Strawberry Way, ask for my colleague there, feller called Hector. He's also one of the, what did you call us again? Discouraged men, Alden. That's it, discouraged men. I like that. Well. Goodbye, Alden, or should I say, adieu. Oh, adieu, Josiah. All 
All right, coach coming south down the river road through Stillwater Strand. So there's a passenger that's very wealthy. Stuff in the strong box. An opera singer. Use your imagination. All right. River Road through Siltwater Strand, he said. Okay. I think I know a good spot to wait. Follow me. What did I tell you? Simple as can be. Seems a lot of the station workers are in on it these days. Earning a pittance. The unions are whipping them up. So they want something on the side. Like he said, there, strawberry. Could create a lot of opportunities for a man in your line of work. I ain't sure about going back to strawberry after all that market business. Didn't sound like you left anyone alive to recognize you, so I wouldn't worry too much, dear boy. All this trouble, you gentlemen are becoming quite the celebrities, aren't you? Soon you'll be on the front of a dime novel. And dead, of course. We're hoping to be long gone before that. Dutch has a plan. If anything goes wrong, let's meet back here at this crossroad, okay? All right. Hmm. What's going to go wrong? safe from sorry so what were you thinking well according to this the loot is located in a strong box which is in the back i'll put on a little performance and you can scurry around open the strong box and relieve them of their goodies and how do i open the strong box without threatening someone to open it for me this should work <laughs> and i can do this silently well i'm hoping complete silence won't be necessary but you're going to wish you had your earplugs this is damson Oh, very good, Alden, very good. Of course, if anything goes wrong, you can wave your guns around like you normally do. Hold tight. They'll be here soon. All right, let's hold tight. There it is. Right on time. Let's go. Keep your distance so they don't see you. And please leave that gun in its holster for once. Okay. I'll try. Sometimes they hit the wrong buttons. I don't mean to. I like the riff. The music. Don't let them spot you or you'll scupper the whole thing. Okay, we're waiting. Could you? It's it's such a small show. Would you do something for me? I'm looking for him. I I I I I don't know. 
Miss Damson, you owe it to West Elizabeth. There we go. We can see her get out. Straight to it. Nice. Okay, let's go to him. My dear boy, teamwork. Here you go. Thank you. Oh, it's only good. Go see Alden from time to time. See you soon, Arthur. Nice. 206 for Robin at Stagecoach. Okay, sir. I like that. Nice. Alright, thanks for watching me still a stagecoach or money from stagecoach. Hopefully you have a good day. And we'll see you on the flip side. If you stuck around this long, I appreciate that. If you liked and if you subscribed, that just means you're a really nice person and you care about supporting content creators like myself. So thank you for that. You have a good day. Bye.